Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Michael at RBM Crypto. Today's short video will be showing you how to store your Terra, your Luna coins on your Ledger Nano X using the Terra station. Now before we jump into it, if you guys are liking the content you're seeing, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel as it helps us grow and helps us bring you guys more content more frequently. Okay, so the first thing we need to do is have our Ledger Nano X plugged into our computer and unlocked via our pin code. And then once you have done so, you'll see here I'm on the portfolio section of the Ledger Live. And what we're going to want to do now is go to Manager. And this is where we're going to add the Terra application to our device. So once this pops up here, what we're going to do is just search for Terra. And as you can see, there's the application. And we're going to hit Install. Now once this is finished installing, that's all you're going to need to do on your Ledger Live account. So once the application is done here, which will be in a few seconds, Perfect. Once this is done, all we need to do now is close our Ledger Live. Okay, so now that we've closed our Ledger Live, what we're going to need to do is go to our Ledger Nano and make sure that we are currently on the Terra application. Once you're on the Terra application, you can hit connect and then go to access with Ledger. And that's all you need to do. As you can see, we're currently now connected to the Terra station, the Terra blockchain. Our address is up here in the top left. And now what we're ready to do is we are ready to send some Terra to our wallet. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to copy my address and head on over to Mandela Exchange to withdraw some Luna coins. As you can see, I currently have some here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste in my address and withdraw my Luna to my Ledger Nano X through Terra Station. One thing to note is when I do this, I'm just obviously going to paste in my address here. And for this account, you'll know that there is no memo. Um, as you can see, it's just the address here. So I'm going to put no memo and then choose the amount that I want to withdraw and withdraw to my account. So just to always know that certain, you know, certain wallets may require you to have a memo. So just be sure before withdrawing um, from certain wallets or certain locations. So now I'm going to withdraw these Luna coins and we'll head on over to Terra Station to see them when they arrive. Okay, and as you can see, I've done the withdrawal process here on Mandela and let's head back on over to Terra Station. And then we can head on over to Wallet. And as you can see now, we have 6.223750 Luna in our account. And our tokens are now on our Ledger device. So if I wanted to unplug my Ledger, I can just unplug my device now and my tokens are safely stored offline. Now, if I want to reverse this process, all I need to do is go to send and I can send my Luna back to a different account. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to paste in my address that I want to send it to and the amount that I want to send. And then as you can see, this is what I was talking about before. Some deposit addresses require a memo for you to put in with your transaction. So what I'll do is I'll head back over to the exchange here and you can see my deposit memo address uh, that I need to deposit my coins to. So I'll just hit copy memo, paste it in here and then hit next and then confirm my transaction with Ledger. And now all you need to do now is go to your Ledger device and confirm your transaction. Scroll through all the details on your Ledger device and then hit confirm. And now as you can see, it is broadcasting a transaction on the network and the funds have been sent back to the exchange. All right, and that's everything for today's video. I've shown you guys how to set up the Terra blockchain through your Ledger Nano X and how to send your Luna tokens from an exchange to your device and how to send them back from the device to the exchange. If you guys are enjoying the content you're seeing, do not forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you all in the next video. Thanks and take care.